Usually you can tell how dominant or submissive your pooch is by observing their interaction with different dogs and animals. While most breeds fall somewhere between dominant and submissive, a few tend to fall squarely on one side or the other. The alpha dog breed takes their role seriously and will never back off a fight. In this video, we have listed 10 most dominant dog breeds with an independent spirit and a protective streak. Let's get it on. Number 10. Sharpe. Sharpe is known to us as a silent, wrinkly breed that has kept a lot of its original traits. Early training and socialization is a must when adopting a Sharpe dog. They are one of the most interesting breeds we have, especially because they tend to have blue tongues. They are also very difficult to train. But even though they are one of the most dominant breeds on the planet, Sharpe's will do well with someone who trains them fairly and with compassion. A harsh approach will do absolutely nothing for these dogs. Number 9. Fox Terrier Fox Terrier is another type of dog that know their worth and will not submit to most barking orders of them. This impulsive breed has a mischievous streak, boundless energy, and a gung-ho attitude. The Fox Terrier needs a handler who knows what they're doing, because this breed knows how to get what they want without putting in any work. Fox Terriers would likely use an inexperienced dog owner as a doormat. Number 8. Jack Russell Terrier you might be wondering what a small dog like the Jack Russell Terrier is doing in our list of most dominant dog breeds. Don't let the size fool you. The Jack Russell Terrier is a handful and can be twice as stubborn and independent as any large dog. Jack Russell Terriers rarely get along with other dogs, and their willful nature makes them extremely hard to train. They also have a high prey drive and enough energy to drive you crazy. Without a firm and consistent trainer, a Jack Russell Terrier won't hesitate to pick a fight with a dog twice their size or try to dominate them. Number 7. Siberian Husky Siberian Huskies are a popular dog breed thanks to their striking appearance and piercing eyes. However, most owners don't realize how stubborn and independent this breed is. These wolf-like dogs require a competent owner to establish his position as a leader. They will test any boundaries you set and take command over the household if you show the slightest hesitation. Moreover, they tend to become destructive inside the house when bored. According to many owners, the Siberian Huskies are one of the worst dog breeds to train because they listen only to the pack leader. So if you fail to earn your Siberian Huskies respect, you'll have a hard time controlling their dominant tendencies. Number 6. Giant Schnauzer while the giant Schnauzer might look intimidating and scary, this amazing dog is highly intelligent, playful, bold, and adventurous. By nature, the giant Schnauzer is suspicious and shy around strangers. That makes this breed an excellent guard dog. But these majestic dogs require a lot of socialization to curb aggression towards unfamiliar people and other animals. Thanks to its dominant personality and independent thinking, the giant Schnauzer isn't right for inexperienced owners or homes with young children. Moreover, the giant Schnauzers aren't dogs who would be happy without their owners. They prefer to stick close to you, and due to their size, they're not suitable for apartments. Number 5. Dogo Argentino like many dogs, Dogo Argentino has quite a reputation around the world for being an aggressive dog breed. The truth is that a well-socialized and trained Dogo Argentino will never attack unprovoked. However, these massive dogs are natural predators and will chase small dogs, cats, and other pets. Moreover, the Dogo Argentino is independent, stubborn, and fiercely protective of their families. Unfortunately, a lot of people take advantage of the strength and intelligence of the breed and train these majestic dogs to fight. A timid owner will have his hands full with this dominant dog breed, so they're more suitable for experienced owners who know how to establish their position as the leader of the pack. Number 4. Neapolitan Mastiff one of the largest dog breeds in the world, the Neapolitan Mastiff is quite the sight with their massive body, intimidating stature, and wrinkled face. Despite their gigantic size, the Neapolitan Mastiff is often described as a gentle giant who is affectionate and playful. But this dog still has a dominant side and will test your boundaries and commands to see if you're serious about them. In addition to this, the Neapolitan Mastiff is quite protective of their family and their deep bark is enough to make thieves and intruders think twice. These dogs are rarely aggressive without a good reason, but they need a confident owner, otherwise they will try to dominate the household. Number 3. American Bulldog The American Bulldog has often been represented in film and television, but they often get mistaken for American Pit Bulls and Dogo Argentino. Initially, the Bulldog was used to bait bulls, which explains their fierceness, bravery, and independence. 
but they also make excellent family dogs because they're very affectionate and loyal. Due to their dominant personality, American Bulldogs are often suspicious of strangers and are always ready to protect their territory. Fortunately, these dogs are eager to please and highly intelligent, so they're easy to train. However, American Bulldogs have high energy needs and don't do well in apartments. In fact, they're one of the breeds most commonly banned from apartment dwellers. Number 2. Caucasian Shepherd Dog the Caucasian Shepherd Dog is a fascinating breed that impresses with its massive size and intellect. These large dogs come from the Caucasian Mountains, where they used to herd livestock and work side by side with shepherds. As a whole, Caucasian Shepherd Dogs are very territorial and make excellent watchdogs. These dogs will never back off a fight and won't hesitate to attack a bear or a wolf to protect their territory. However, their fierceness and dominance are what makes them difficult to train and a bad choice for first-time owners. These giants of the dog world should be well socialized to curb their natural suspiciousness of strangers and aggression towards other animals. And number one, Bora Bull. The moment you see a muscular and intimidating Bora Bull, you know that you have a dog that will make an excellent guard dog. You'd be right because the Bora Bull is naturally suspicious of strangers and very territorial. However, while the Bora Bull are excellent guards, these powerful dogs are also very affectionate, sweet, and eager to please. They make perfect family dogs as long as they're well trained. Since they're one of the most dominant dog breeds, the Bora Bull requires a confident owner to set boundaries and a lot of early socialization to prevent aggression. That concludes our video of the 10 most dominant dog breeds. What other breeds do you think should be on the list? Let us know in the comments. And if you like this video, then subscribe and turn on notifications so you'll be the first to know when a new video comes out. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.